and welcome to this Cleffy video where today we're going to talk about the 149 series fan coil hookup kit with 40mm centres. In any new fan coil installation there's a lot of pre-work that needs to be carried out to ensure the efficiency of the system. This includes flushing through the horizontal mains, flushing through the mains floor by floor, flushing through the entire system and a two-stage flush through the terminal unit included forward flush and backward flush to drain. Steps 1, 2 and 3 are carried out using the bypass unit. Step 4 is carried out flushing to drain. To enable us to achieve the correct outcome, we must use the following components. Two shutoff valves to isolate the terminal unit. One shutoff valve to control the bypass line. One wipe pattern strainer to prevent dirt from entering the terminal unit. One balancing valve to control the flow rate inside the terminal unit and a zone valve for the remote control. All of these connections together mean that we have 20 hydraulic connections in the unit. This means a greater space for installation but also a longer time for the installer. Once this process is complete we have to regulate the flow for each terminal unit. This is achieved by selecting the correct valve set point on the PICV. Due to the complex functions and requirements we must use a series of different components to enable us to achieve the correct outcome. To simplify life for the installer, it is possible to use a connection and regulation kit for HVAC terminal units. This kit contains all of the necessary components for the commissioning and maintenance of HVAC systems. The unit is designed with 40mm sensors to allow direct connection to UK fan coils. We will now take a closer look at the 149 series hookup kit with 40mm sensors. In this pre-assembled kit, there are no internal joints, but there are all the necessary components for the correct installation of the HVAC terminal unit. There is also the possibility to choose different actuators to combine with the system's control monitoring system. These include 0 to 10 volts, 230 volts and 24 volt actuators. These can be installed vertically or horizontally. Here we have an example of a 149 series 40mm sensors over a drip tray on a UK fan coil. All the components are here, flow return, heated and chilled. The three-way combination valve allows us to carry out three separate functions. Bypassing the terminal unit for initial flushing or to maintain circulation during unit maintenance, flush through the fan core unit, forward and reverse flushing bypassing the PICV. We'll now take a look at maintaining the strainer. Firstly, ensure that both valves are isolated so no water can pass through the system. We then take a 17mm Allen key where we remove the centre nut. The strainer is then removed and can be cleaned ready for reinstallation. Ensuring we have both locating pins inside the valve, reinsert the strainer and tighten to ensure we don't have any leaks. Using the Flowmatic PICV, it is possible to preset the maximum flow rate for each terminal unit. To achieve this, we unscrew the plastic cap by hand. We can then gain access to the adjustment scale. The scale is indicated from 2 to 10. Each number relates to a corresponding flow rate. The operating range of the valve is also indicated on this scale. Using the adjustment scale for indication, we can now set the desired flow rate through the PICV. Each number on the scale adjustment relates to a presetable flow rate. The valve will modulate to control the delta P. The valve controls delta P to ensure the flow rate remains constant at the preset value, regardless of change in system conditions. Also, using the actuator, the valve can adjust the flow rate depending on the system demands. Using the two pre-installed pressure ports, it is possible to connect a measuring device. The reason for this is to ensure we have the correct DP flowing through the valve to guarantee optimum performance. Using the Venturi profile, it is possible to check the flow rate through the unit. The Venturi profile has a fixed KV. Because of this, with the help of a measuring station, it is possible to measure the total flow and set it to the desired value. Thank you for watching this video where we talked about the 149 series hookup kit. I hope you enjoyed it. For more information, please visit our website at www.kalefi.com or go to our YouTube page where we have more videos. 
Thank you for watching.